Hey guys, welcome to my Infiltrator uh, LP, uh, which we will, today we will do that, as I said, doing, doing some Infiltrator action, and uh, you have the Cloak ability, which makes you go completely invisible. The only things that can see you are Jammers, which the Raider, which is basically one of your direct counters, uh, can can use to to spot you. And it drains my energy slowly, uh, If I and it's based upon the same energy pool as my jetpack, so I have to be very cautious about it. Um, or the other thing is, uh, the other, the other class that gets it is, um, Sentinel, which is actually something you counter, but that's could be one of his packs. It's something to help him against, uh, but it won't really help him. You still are much better than, uh, a Sentinel. And so, uh, specifically with this class let out, uh, I like to melee. It's a class I've really been into as of late because of, uh, because of the shock lance. It's a weapon that, that does a lot of back damage, and what better class to do that than the, the one that goes invisible. Uh, you get a bunch of pistols and throwing knives and th things like that. Um, all projectile-based weapons, basically. SMG, stealth spin fuser. Uh, Jackal is more for traps and stuff. I'll be showing you that later. Not one of my favorite weapons, uh, but we'll see. And SMGs, I've, I've already shown you my amazing aim with that in the tutorial. And uh, smoke grenades uh, are something that lets me go invisible immediately. We also get mines if we choose to, or sticky grenades. Uh, for my perks I use, uh, at least for this class, is Close Combat, which gives me double backstab damage. I also get a bit of protection from melee damage if they decide to melee me back. Yes, this game has melee. And I also get Quick Draw, so I can uh, I can switch weapons faster. And so, me uh, specifically, I have a voice pack where I say, I sound like an Australian guy. And I unfortunately did not do a uh, jump there. So we're g this is actually a nice map. It's one of the new ones in the Game of the Year edition. Uh, I really like this. This is one of my favorites, I, I definitely think. Uh, there's a, it's like a giant moon base. And so a giant turret there is, is, is firing at me. So we're going to go here. Another thing that can make you go, in, uh, that make people see you, is uh, if you're going too fast. If you're going over 180, they'll be able to see you. You get automatically lit up, basically. But what you are is you're, you don't really cap flags. You can cap flags if you choose to. But your job is more about uh, har harassing and causing problems for the other team. So, I think there was a guy here last time. So we're going to go take out that turret. And you you do unstealth if you do fire your weapon. Uh oh. And I just killed that guy in the back. So his generator is basically ours to go and kill. So that's one of the things you are really good at. If you had sticky grenades, you'd be much more effective as a guy who takes down generators. But I... I Personally, I have two explosive weapons, and I think I, I'm fine. And someone shot, shot me with the Arx Buster. That would be a Raider. Uh, I, I couldn't see him up there. And he also has that Jammer pack, so he's going to be my biggest uh, problem. Oh, I'm surprised I didn't get him. And so it's, that's basically a Pathfinder, and we just killed him. So I was just helping to defend my base. Remember to always kind of help t teammates out. The flag is the more important thing. Uh, you honestly want to get the flag. Uh, you want to protect your own flag. Actually, there was something I should have shown you, but I'll show you it later. Uh, so I use the shock lance in stealth. I love it, and I it's actually like before before the shock lance, you are were not able to kill a, a heavy in in basically in one hit. Uh, with the shock lance, you now can. Uh, will that get nerfed? I hope not. I have a lot of fun with it. And someone just tried to motor me. Okay, so we got that turret. I have to be very careful. I have to be very cautious about people trying to shoot me. Because this guy in particular, he saw me, but he opted to... Okay, so here's a guy. Let me see if I can go backstab him. Okay, I couldn't backstab him. I'm getting jammed, unfortunately. Not the good kind of jam. He still hasn't seen me. Okay, and I'm going to go invisible. Now he can't see me. He may give up on me. My energy's gonna run out really soon. I should also mention these. I forgot to mention these blue force fields. It's free jetpack, so I can go up here. Okay, let's let's now go. There you go. Even though I didn't really backstab him, uh, you know, I harassed him. That's my job. I wonder if someone saw me. I I, I felt I felt a spin fuser fire nearby. Okay, there's a lot of players here, so. Okay, I don't want to really stay near that guy. So let's just fire in this corridor a little bit. Uh, too far range. 
Okay, we're just gonna run away because I only have 44, and we're just gonna use the uh, air cloak, and we can easily get away. He's he's right now trying to spam a pistol at me, but you know, there's really no way for him to know where I actually am. So you know, we're okay, and we just got a cap. So you'll notice something is I'm not really a capper. I'm not too good at capping. The most I'll cap with is probably soldier. I don't because you know I I go I'm I'm bad pathfinder. I'm a bad at pathfinder. I'm gonna take out these mines so. I'm surprised you didn't actually get me there. Okay, I'm gonna wait for him to come back. Come back. There you go. Oh, look at that blue plate. Nice. Even though really it wasn't that skilled, but you know. Okay, and this guy could probably kill him like one hit. Unfortunately, I didn't do it, and I pressed like some sort of menu. Okay, let's go over here. He's gonna just—they're gonna spam at me. You know, the more distracted they are with me, the better off we are. Um, surprised that it didn't work. Oh, fuck me. Okay, I didn't do very good there. I think I had like a... Oh wow, my ping just went up to 121. Yeah, ping when I record, not too good. Actually, my ping in this game in general kind of sucks. I don't really understand it. Uh, I joined like a 60 ping server and I'm up. This is a problem related only to myself, don't worry about it. I, I don't really know what causes this, but... Oh shit, wait. I'm, yeah, I'm gonna go back to base because I want to show you something. Actually, it looks like there's a there's a guy spamming our point here, and this is a great opportunity for me to show you my awesome backstab ability. And I get to one hit people. He couldn't even turn around. I I hit him with a shock lance in the back and a backstab. And when you have those all together, uh, you ba the, the the disadvantage of this it may seem really powerful, but it only really works for people who are like standing still. Uh, so they're like not really doing a very good job. Uh, Cause you, you should you should just move around at least side to side, make it a little bit difficult for me. But he was trying to get a good aim over here. Okay, so someone's actually firing over there. And this is this is like a band cannon. We... And it makes you go fast. So if you're really bad at going fast, uh, but you want to get a little taste of it. Okay, I'm gonna go attack this guy. If, if I attack this guy again. Uh oh, I have another fellow infiltrator here. He is cloaked, he can't see it though. Oh, we dude, that was mine. And I don't know where that other juggernaut got, went. And someone's constantly giving advice. Retrieve our flag. <laughs> the, the 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 chat in this game that goes back and forth, it's it's really fun to listen to. It's it's honestly one of the best things about this game. This game really doesn't need voice chat. Okay, I tried to go get this guy. And I just replied yes to him. So I'm gonna try and get the flag carrier because that I'm really good at actually doing that. If I get the opportunity to, uh, it's a little bit difficult to. I can also gain I can also gain speed pretty much just like uh, oh flag. shit. Our flag has been captured. Oh crap! All right. Oh, I almost got that guy. Okay, I don't want to take the flag, but I don't want to take it while I'm going slow. Oh, I didn't, I didn't cloak. Oh, uh, this one, this guy, unfortunately, uh, this is a raider with the jammer pack, and he is my direct counter. Like, th this is the guy I would have the most problem with. Uh, in this game, in this game, basically, uh, your biggest problems as an infiltrator is uh, dealing with um, player. Like, you, you are at a severe disadvantage. You're supposed to use your cloak to. Surprise enemies. We have captured the Blood Eagle flag. You got another cap, luckily. You're supposed to use your cloak to surprise other players. Um, however, if you can't, if you can't do that, you're at an automatic disadvantage usually. Uh, except in cases like Sentinels and stuff, where they're inherently weak at uh, close range of captures to begin with. So. All right, we got it. Uh oh, gonna run away. Someone's chasing after me. Oh, he saw me. What? And this guy, this guy got seen too. Now, you would think in a game like this, actually, um, I, I do have to say that the hackers would be rampant, but they're not. Uh, it's actually with a lot of PC games. It's even a free-to-play game, and not a whole lot of hackers. I've, I think there's only been, like, I've played this game for well over 200 hours, and I think I've only seen people cheating 
it'd be twice, like obvious cheating. There are a really good players in this game. The thing is, if you're a really good player, you will beat hackers every time, which is why they don't even bother. And also, that's a Shrike, uh, if I didn't show you what that was. Now, I can go try and cap this. Uh, it's not in my best interest to. Oh, fuck. Okay, well, whatever. This guy's attempting to go on the Shrike. And so now I'm just trying to rush back to my base. Try to use the hills to my advantage. And the, the little kick-ass music just starts up. Fortunately, I'm now going slow, and I'm not very happy about this. I lost my speed. I'm going to ask him to take the flag from me. One second, I'm going to try something. Damn it. I thought I was being smart, and I would, I would blow it away from him and try and kill him, but uh, I fired too late. That was my own mistake. The flag, you don't always get it. Uh, it's kind of one of those things where uh, you go for it if you're going fast. Uh, if you're not, then don't bother with it. And also, if you see someone with a flag, maybe it's a good idea to go try and help them out. Yeah, see, this guy lost it. Uh, you know, it, it really depends. Uh, there's a Pathfinder role you can have called chasing. And when you chase, you're it's basically attempting to uh, get people who have the flag. And they are very, very, very powerful. Oh, there we go. Something hit me, and it actually helped me out. Uh, unfortunately, I think I'm going to be slowing down. Nope, that turret actually got me. Uh, the thing I actually didn't mention about the turrets is that they're 100% accurate, assuming that you do not change your current trajectory. So if you don't jetpack up or down a little bit, that's how you prevent it. Uh, and they also do splash damage. I think he killed me with splash. I don't think it was a direct hit. But they will directly hit you every time. Uh, so, it, you know, it's up to hate them. Like, they're not particularly powerful yeah, with that regard. And also, I should probably stop capping because that's not really my role. I should harass. We have the Blood Eagle flag. Blood okay, Eagle so I'm, I'm moving in. Flag. Okay, well, I killed them anyways. By the way, people get assists if they hit at least once. Uh, there's some other variables with it, like, I guess how soon you've hit them. Uh oh. Let me try and help this guy out. Blood Damn it. Has their flag. We can try and get the hell out of here. Nope, he knew where I was. When people hit you, that's kind of what happens. Let me just use my invisibility thing. And uh, the smoke grenade also prevents damage from lighting me up for a little while, so I'm just going to run into here and get some... There is health regeneration in this game, so, you know, just keep that in mind. You just wait a couple seconds. The heavier the heavier the class you are, the, the more trouble you'll have. Oh, uh, he threw a grenade. Oh, I'm glad you didn't see me. So I could just wait for a second, maybe he'll come out and try and see what the hell I'm doing. And unfortunately, I think I think that... Uh-oh. Hey, what's up? We can try and kill that guy together. I love the stealth spin fuser, it's a lot of fun. It really is. It's like it's just like a normal spin fuser, it's kind of a neutered normal spin fuser. Because uh, obviously you wouldn't want to have... Me having like... Really good... Uh, spin fuser capabilities. Uh oh, I'm being jammed by a raider pack. Oh, god damn it. Yeah, that, that's what that raider does to you. Okay, so we're gonna switch it up to, let's say, the jackal, just to kind of show off the, the capabilities. A uh, jackal itself is just has like three, you just kind of just fire it three times. It's really slow. It used to not be this slow. Oh, we lost. Alright, I'll show you next round. Oh, here's my final score and everything. I was just kind of going to let it kind of go to the end. But uh, got five kills. I died seven times. Did do particularly well. Uh, Could have done much better. Uh, and you can see kind of all, all the kinds of rewards and things like that. And also, if you want to see people chatting, you just press the tilde key and you can say, too bad, not a full game, some guy says. So it's kind of interesting to note. I want to be Blood Eagle Master Race. I'm always Blood Eagle. Okay. 
So now we're gonna switch to the Jackal uh, loadout bay. Oh, that sounds good to do. This is one of my favorite maps, by the way. Does this music not remind you of like Unreal Tournament? So honestly, one of the biggest problems with the Jackal is you lose some of that pr propulsion uh, ability that you once had. And, but we're on a, like a desert map. This map has kind of like little cool intertube things. Uh, anytime. The guy's probably gonna shoot. That's the guy's we probably gonna shoot him. Yeah, uh, shoot me. Yeah, it's not a really good passing. Uh oh, uh, turret shot me. That's okay. So we can use one of these things and we can go fast. And then before I go to the end, I'm gonna. Uh oh. Uh oh. Okay, I just I just kind of laid a trap there. I, I forgot that's the only kind of mines I had. The sorters have our flag. Oh fuck, I keep forgetting I don't actually have the proper mines. Our flag is secure. Our generator has been destroyed. Oh, I'm dead. There's unfortunately not a whole lot of places for me to hide in a tube like this. And they have a lot of players uh, defending that generator. And you'll find that actually a lot in games where a lot of people love that generator. And some people have some really annoying voice packs. And so these are my knives. They're kind of projectile weapons. Very difficult to use. I can't do it very well. Alright, so let's see. We're gonna go up here. Let's run away. So that's- I'm trying to harass. It's really difficult to, to do this effectively. This guy thinks he knows where I am. Oh, come on. Let me get away. Oh, and I died. I didn't see- there was a- someone's turret there, so they all saw me. With the, Without the smoke grenades, you lose a lot of your stealthing abilities. It makes me kind of sad. You know, honestly, I'm much better with the melee. Uh, and you have to be very patient. It's a patient class. I'm not playing it very patiently. That's why I'm losing. And I think one of the other problems might be here is that they're really over over defending right now. And where was that turret that killed me the last time? Okay, this is a mine. Be careful about that. Oh, I think it's right there. Okay. Uh, so I have a couple of options here. Oh. Oh, there's there's a turret. Let's run away. They have turrets everywhere. How many technicians do they have? I'm trying to look. Uh, four technicians. That's too many technicians, to be honest. I'm trying to kill this guy. I'm not very good at this. I, I don't even know why I have the knives. They're fucking impossible for me to aim. And that thing's dead. Okay, I'm not. I'm never using that setup ever again. This is like the, my two worst weapons. Let's go with... Uh, I have a class actually just for using Sonic Punch, which uh, enables dropping a flag. So if they have the flag and they're like camping with it, I often go this. Let's actually go with um, something with the SMG this time, just to so you guys get a taste. So this is actually a variation on my melee setup that you were watching me play with earlier. Also, I'm going over 180, so my, uh, uh, I, 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 I'm basically seeing every single time. Uh, like, it, it goes through my stealth. Okay, we're gonna go down here. And so that's what the SMG is for. I also have sticky grenades, so I can fire some stickies. There, I killed a guy. There, motor, there's a guy with a motor in here. So what I'm gonna try and do is I'm gonna try and go here. And so I'm skiing just a little bit just so I go fast. And I just noticed this thing, so I can fire out a bit, set it off. The engineer will now know I'm here though, uh, cause he can tell that I've set it off. And so I can, I can kill these turrets too. Cause the shock lance isn't as good at doing that. These engineers really set up, set up shot tight, uh, shut up. Okay, so this guy doesn't know I'm here. Uh-oh. Fuck. Got grenade launchered. And look, it's a raider. There's always a raider on the other team, it seems, that wants to screw up this LP for me. Alright. 
So I can now go set reset this guy's health regeneration, and he just got air shotted by that thing. And I should run away because that was a, that was a mine of some sort. <laughs> Anyways, yeah. So uh, any more? That dialogue is great. I love it. So I have a, as I said, this is a, this is a spin-off of my melee, uh, my melee strategy we were watching we do before. So basically, I can melee people from the front and then SMG them to finish them off. They have a really tight defense here. Uh, I don't think I'm gonna be able to do much. I think this guy, what the hell is he firing at? Oh, he's firing at that guy. They're, they saw me. There we go. Go and for, be opportunistic, and just go for the kill. You know? Okay, come on. L let me have an opening. Okay, he's... Oh, damn it. Let's, let's just run away. Okay, let's go but let's go behind him like this. He's like, oh, is he is Mike over here? Ah, oh, damn it. I wasn't I wasn't close enough. So this is not a bad bad thing, although I don't want to be taking on multiple people, so I'm gonna try and get the hell out of here. I can't, unfortunately. This is this is where the smoke grenades really come in handy because I would be able to go invi like we invisible instantly, and I also if they were if they were in the process of shooting me, they I wouldn't get revealed for like three seconds or something. You know, I, I wouldn't they wouldn't see me. Unfortunately, my aim is really terrible, so let's go invisible, and. Uh, <laughs> but he's, he's telling me he's the greatest. He doesn't know where I quite am. Oops. He's distracted with someone else. That's probably one of the best times to go. By the way, th that Devastator spin fuser he has, that's what it is. It'll kill me in one hit on a direct shot. Uh, it kills all lights and most of the mediums. It's really hard to actually see on this map. There we go, we finished him off. I was a little bit worried there, I really was. Oh wait, there's a guy right here. Oh, that's the same guy. He's he's having a little fun with the, the BGS system, and I I love that. It's 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 hilarious. If if you don't play the game for like going fast, at least go play it for like that kind of shit. It's like fun. Apparently, that doesn't do any damage. I didn't know that. Okay, because this does damage to turrets and generators. All right, let's go and uh, let's go chase this guy right here. Oh, how'd I miss that? I'm terrible. I'm awful. Get out of here. I'm, I'm depressed. I'm gonna go over here. Is he gonna chase after me? I love the shock lance though. It's just, it's one of my, one of my, one of my favorite. Oh, we got our cap. Nice stuff. Alright. Let's try and get closer to here. Oh. Damn it to hell. Okay, we're gonna go over all the way this way. Oh god, the turret sees me and wants me. Hi turret, don't 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 come after me. Oh, there, I have my fellow uh, we have the flag. fellow. I don't like your turret. It annoys me. Oh, this technician is like, hey, some something's fishy going on here, and unfortunately, I can never quite get that range. Okay, so I distracted him for just a second, and I'm going to now. Get hit a whole bunch and and probably die. Okay, I don't. Ha I'm not. I, I gotta. I gotta get away from him because my cloak was running out. No, we have captured the diamond. Hopefully he won't. Oh, okay, I, I looked over here. I'm like, oh, is there a red like dot? Like someone was just kind of watching me. I have the flag. All right, let's try and go to their gen room like this. Uh, right now, I, I don't have... By the way, when I'm uncloaked, their sensors can see me, but luckily their sensors are not online. Uh, so, I'm, I'm okay. But you can see, like, how, like, it's it's a fun class. It's not, like, disguising and shooting all the other players. Uh-oh. Oh, damn it. Let's get the hell out of here. What? How did I... Later. Uh, I don't really know how I didn't go fast through that thing, but whatever. 